uh, hi everyone welcome to this session so let's solve uh, this uh, interview question okay so basically we have a mod based circuit with some capacitance and an a inverter okay we have to assume this c1 and c2 are very large large than the parasitic capacitance of this mosfet sets okay of this mosses and this is a cross coupled mos right and this structure is called cross coupled latch okay this section is called cross coupled latch because this is acts as a latch okay so it it can hold its previous voltages okay this node and this node can hold its previous voltages so now let's solve it uh, so actually we have a vdd here and the same vdd uh, like the uh, and we have a clock of same vdd okay and 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 the like the clock is from 0 to vdd at this inverter input of the inverter so let's say when the v in is 0 okay v in is 0 volt what will happen at this node and we are assuming uh, both the capacitor are initially uncharged so vc1 vc2 at 0 minus will be 0 volt okay so when v in is 0 so this is 0 okay let me change the color of component okay so this is 0 so inverter will give a output of 1 okay 1 means this will be vdd so 0 means 0 and 1 means vdd we all know so this vdd so this capacitor was initially uncharged so across this across the c2 it was 0 volt okay so and uh, we are assuming the like the uh, mosfets mosfets have has some finite small finite on resistance okay mos has finite small resistance small r1 okay small r1 so this vdd will reach there because the capacitor uh, want to make the zero voltage across it so if this is vdd this node goes to vdd as well okay so if this is vdd so this node is vdd so here gate of the n mos is vdd as well okay and if this is zero this initial the vc of like the voltage across the c1 was initially zero so if this is zero this node is zero so this node is also zero volt okay so if this is zero so the gate of this m2 will be zero so now what will happen so this m2 mosfet will turn on because it is getting some vsg sufficient vsg okay vsg of vdd because this is zero and this is vdd so it will turn on and this uh, uh, pmos is a good pass good pass of logic high good pass of logic high so this vdd will reach there right so by looking at this circuit from v to from v like from this path to that path this node voltage is happy to have a voltage of vdd right like in this v to inverter path this voltage wanted, wanted to be vdd and from that path from that uh, mosfet path the vdd is also come to that vb node okay so this node is happy with vb so at v in equals 0 our vb is vdd and our va is 0 volt okay now what will happen when the v in is vdd when v in is vdd now so analyze the circuit again so let me change the color of my pen now so this is vdd so inverter will make this node to zero and we are like considering about the uh, steady state conditions okay so if this is zero so this node voltage will try to make zero okay as initial conditions was zero okay like the previously when this is this was uh, vdd this was also vdd so initial condition was zero uh, previously as well okay so if this is node zero this node is goes zero this node is goes zero so if this node is vdd and this like uh, this capacitor will try to maintain the zero potential across it so this va will go to vdd as well okay so now we can see similar thing will happen 
so if this vdd is here so the gate of this m2 will gets vdd as well so if this is vdd so this m2 mosfet is now off because vsd becomes zero because this is vdd and this is also vdd so this m2 mosfet is turned off okay m2 is turned off <coughs> and this m1 is turned on because this is get a sufficient vsg of vdd right because this is uh, the vs is vdd and vg is zero so it gets sufficient vsg so this is a good logic high pass like the pmos can pass a high logic easily so this voltage is reaching there vdd so similar thing will happen so from the v in path this vpa node is trying to uh, go to vdd and from the a from the uh, uh, from the pmos uh, six and from the pmos branch this vdd is also trying to reach this va node okay so this node is also happy okay so this is a final solution so when vn is zero our vv is zero volt and va is vdd okay so that's that's all okay so actually uh, we are assuming all the like the steady state condition but it will eventually will be a uh, capacitive charging and discharging okay capacitive charging and discharging and it will be very fast charging and discharging because we are assuming c on like rc rc r equivalent or c equivalent of the circuit is very very lower okay because the r on will be very very lower in the range of in practical life it will be milli ohm milli milli ohm range oh, milli ohm range okay so milli ohm range so rc will be very very lower and this capacitor we generally not directly use as like that there will be some capacitance present here okay so now what will be the final waveform so let me draw the all waveforms so it is our v in so i am i am telling all of the steady stress conditions okay but eventually if there is a finite resistance of this r on of this mosfet is and the c is also a finite value so it will be a it will be a first order rc charging okay exponential charging will be there so this is v in it is goes from zero to vdd so when so let me draw the vb first so this is vv so when this is zero it will be vdd and when vdd it will be like that so this will be vdd this will be zero and vb or va are the complementary things so it will be opposite okay so this will be zero and this will be high so this is zero this is vdd so actually the vb uh, va is uh, following the v in itself okay the vb this uh, sorry the va va node is following the v in right va is following v in okay so this is the final solution so actually this is a simple circuit but you have to analyze uh, uh, like in, in this way okay so if there is a let's say the charging will be in the case so i can write so let's say so it will be not like that so it will be like that okay Like the charging and discharging will be first but exponential okay so this will be the real practical case okay thank you everyone you can put your valuable feedbacks thank you